Why did the government just bury the Las Vegas shooting? Why, why, why wasn't that? Why wasn't there a huge outcry? I know the gun nuts came out there and did all that stuff, but why no? Why no? Why we did? We never got any answers, did we? We never got any answers because again, it didn't fit the narrative and the agenda. And who knows? Maybe that whole thing was the agenda. We still don't know. We don't know. We don't know what was behind it. We don't know the motives. We don't know the motivation. That I know that the government lies to you. I know the media lies to you. I've just proven it over. Uh, Hollywood lies to you. We saw Matt McConaughey just the other day. So what's the truth? Why don't they want to get the bottom of it? No, they want to talk about Uvalde. They want to talk about kids because that pulls at your heartstrings. And I'll tell you why they're telling the lies. Because it's an election cycle. Bottom line. And no, folks, AR in AR-15 doesn't stand for automatic rifle or assault rifle. It doesn't stand for assault rifle. <sighs> there was a guy the other day who sent in a video to a news organization, and they shared it. He was doing his part. He was tearing up. He was breaking apart his AR-15 and rendering it useless. And he was beating it with a hammer, big ball-peen hammer. And he was wearing sandals. And I said, BS. BS. This guy, he is not a shooter. He, he is not an enthusiast. Uh, this is a setup. This is a ploy. This is another thing. And by the way, he was using an assault hammer. You, people get killed with hammers. I don't know if you know this or not. Let me use your logic for you. Let me use your logic for you. So, oh, well, your founding fathers, you guys didn't have these, uh, these rifles in mind whenever they wrote the Second Amendment. Do you know, if you look it up, you can look it up. George Washington was born in 1732. He died in, oh, 1799-ish, 1790-something. Do you know that guns and their technology changed during George Washington's lifestyle? Or during his lifetime? They, they changed. They got better. The technology got better. They invented new guns. That's right. During our, fa our founding father's lifetime, gun technology advanced. And it's advanced in every generation. You know why? They weren't looking for a better way to kill squirrels. They were looking for a way to not only protect, defeat themselves, but to protect themselves. So it's always happened. It's always been that way, and it will always continue to be that way. So don't, so don't pull the founding fathers into this thing. They knew exactly what they were doing. You think our founding fathers created this thing that is nothing almost short of inspired by God in the Constitution, the Declaration of Independence, these incredible documents, and they didn't have the foresight to see what those, <laughs> what those firearms were supposed to be used for? But the potential behind it, why they put the Second Amendment in there, you don't think they were smart enough to realize that? And unless you guys are, are sending me these hate messages writing with a feathered quill, then I don't want to hear about, well, our founding fathers. Our founding fathers didn't foresee Facebook or the Internet either. They didn't foresee computers. They didn't foresee email. But you're communicating with them right now, right? Now, what if I said, you know what, we don't need these cars that we have today, these big trucks, these big fast vehicles that you can plow into a crowd of people and kill and murder and, and maim and cripple. No, we need to all go back to the Model T. We need to all go back to the Model T. It goes about 12 miles an hour. You ain't going to hurt nobody with a Model T. So let's make sure that we take anything that can be used as a weapon and bring it all the way back to its original model. And then we're going to say, you know what, everybody in America... We're going to stop drunk driving deaths right now. We're going to have sensible automobile control. It's going to be smart. We're taking it all back to the Model T. You see where I'm going with this, right? You see where I'm going? Because it's the same damn logic they use towards guns. It's ridiculous. It's bad logic. And there's not a law you can pass that's going to make a single bit of difference. You can ban every gun. People still find a way to hurt each other.